but the customer service, right? I, I run into it a lot, the customer service, because I handle in my house all the hookups, internet, whatever we need, gas, I do all that. I got on the phone with the cable people, right? I don't know if you ever try hook up cable over the phone with these people. There's a pre-recorded message that says, we're gonna monitor the call for quality assurance, right? <laughs> so as soon as I get a live operator, I tell them, just so you know, I'm recording the call on my end too, okay? <laughs> you got me, I got you. Behave, behave. So the next morning, I come down for breakfast. I got a guy in my yard already. Cable guy's in the yard already. My wife is like, what is he doing? I go, I don't know. Now, I handle that. That's another thing you handle as a husband. You got a guy in your yard, you take care of that. You don't send your wife, go, go see. Go out there. As a husband, you have to handle stuff. You make reservations to a restaurant, as the man, you check in. You go right up to the, I got a two man of skunk up tonight. You got that? You don't send your wife. I see it all the time. Wives go up. Hi, we're here. Two for uh, Johnson. It's ready. Honey, you wanna? It's ready, honey. You wanna come up here? <laughs> handle it. So I handle the cable guy. I come outside in the yard. Hey, what's going on? What are you doing? Oh, no, I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't get it. The, the cable, I can't get it. What? You don't come to the door, introduce yourself. How'd you get back here? I can't do it. I gotta take a break. Break? You didn't do nothing. He's telling me he can't hook the cable up because the cable's in my neighbor's yard. I gotta ask my neighbor if it's okay for him to go get the cable. I go, Julio, you broke into my yard. Can't you just break into his? It's your cable, go get the damn thing. I can do it. So me and Julio go over to my neighbor. I just moved into the neighborhood. I don't even know the guy. I knock on the door, the guy came to the door, had a full medical mask on. If you have a medical mask on and you answer the door, that's gotta be the first thing out of your mouth, okay? Why you got this damn thing on? <laughs> I come to my door with a medical mask, I take it down, listen, doing some painting in the, in the garage, gets into my lungs, that's why I got the mask. <laughs> this guy, nothing on the mask. Started talking through the mask. He's like, what's going on? I go, no, no, no. What's going on in here? I just bought the joint next door. Do I gotta put it up for sale? Why the hell do you got a medical mask on on a Monday morning, okay? Let's get into that. I'm gonna send Julio in your yard. Is he gonna come out with no head? What are you doing with the mask? I live in the negative. Live in the negative. My wife is in the positive, okay? Came back to, to our house. I said, put the for sale sign up. There's a guy with a medical mask living next door. She's like, maybe he has a respiratory problem and that's why he has the mask. I go, or maybe he's got 16 bodies in drums in formaldehyde in his basement. Put the sign up, we're moving. <laughs>